Hey everyone, so today is my first YouTube video and today I'm going to be unboxing three Peter Stones on the Remington Mole. Um, I got all three of these horses off of Facebook um, from the Peter Stone sales page and I got them from the same um, lady and she was very friendly. I think I got really good prices on them. Um, so I'm just like really happy to finally have a few horses on the Remington Mold, or at least even just one horse on the Remington Mold, because it has been so hard to find one. It's even been hard to find one just like on the secondhand marketplace. Like, literally, have looked at eBay, like sales pages, haven't seen any pop up in a few weeks. And I am new to collecting Peter Stones, so I don't know too terribly much about them, but I've been doing as much reading as possible and looking at all the different moles throughout the years and I have really, really grown fond of the Remington mold. Um, I don't know, just something about it that like really looks, I don't know, wild and free to me. So I really like it. Um, so I've already unboxed some of them just to save some time and speed the process up, but I haven't unwrapped any of them fully yet. So let's get started with this one. So this one is the gunner um so it's like this one is from the stone bowl and this is the short main version which i'm kind of happy about because i do really like the short main version um i like the long main version too but i think the short main version is going to be the one i like more but then again i have not seen see them in person yet so you know everything is different once you see it in person so here is Gunner. Let me move this so you can probably see it better. It's really nice chestnut color and the shading is really nice. Has blue eyes and like little I don't know if you can see it, but like little white paint specks here and there. So it's just really, really lovely. I don't know if you can see it too well. I'm using my phone to record because being this is my first YouTube video, I have no idea what I'm doing right now. So you can see the face. Oh, she's he's so gorgeous. I really like how it's almost tilting as if it's going to fall over, but it doesn't. It's just so well done. And even the mold, just perfect. I really like it. And so here is the card for Gunner, which is really cute. So this is a run of 15. So I'm assuming the other 15 is gonna be the one that was the long main version. Um, so yeah, kind of curious to see like which one people like more, either the short main or the long main version. I think I like it better from this side. Anyway, so. This one's that's gunner, and let's get into opening the other two. And we'll save we'll save the best for last. So let's untape this one. And I really appreciate when people do a good packing job. So thank you to the girl who sold me these horses because they were packed very well, which I appreciate. So 
actually only have two other Peter stones before I got these because I bought a lot of briars off of eBay. Um, and at the time, I didn't know that the, the two, there were two horses that I couldn't identify and I didn't realize that they were just a different brand. I just thought maybe they were an older briar mold that I couldn't find for some reason on identifier briar, but it turned out when they got here that they were Peter Stones. So I had to look it up and that's kind of where all this began a few months ago. I was like really impressed with the quality of their horses. So this one is Blue Thunder. Oh my goodness. So pretty. I think I'm going to be a fan of the matte version more than, I believe it's the satin finish maybe, or the, I know in Briar they call it gloss. So, wow. This one actually might be my favorite. We'll, we'll determine that once I open the other one. So I get a closer look so you guys can see. Absolutely beautiful. Really, really like, love this color on this mold. There's something about it that, I don't know, it looks very realistic. And I hope you guys can actually see this. Like I said, this is the first time I'm doing a YouTube video, so probably not doing a really good job with placement, but whatever, I'll figure it out as I go. Absolutely beautiful. Has beautiful brown eyes. Yep, so this is Blue Thunder. Um, and I hope you guys were able to see this one pretty well. But like pictures do not even do justice. I've seen pictures of this horse on the internet, but again, I've never seen this horse in person or even the mold in person. But I knew immediately when I saw the photos that this was going to be one of my most favorite molds, if not my most favorite mold, even between Peter Stone and Briar. So, all right, let's go ahead and unwrap the final one, which I think might be the coolest one. We'll have to see. So this one is Lazarus, and Lazarus was the Halloween horse, I believe, for this past year. Yep, for 2021 Moon, Moonlight Madness event. And this one is six out of 30. Um, I don't know about you guys, but I really love the Halloween horses, even the ones that um, Briar does. So to even, I didn't even realize that Peter Stone even like made Halloween horses. So I like went back in the, I guess the archives on their website and like looked at all the ones they had for Moonlight Madness and they were all very beautiful, but of course, definitely wanted the one on the Remington mold. So let's go ahead and open him up. And this one even comes with a flashlight because I think his paint is like some type of like paint that like activates with black light and it changes colors, I guess. So when it's dark and you put the light on it, his color looks more brown, or at least that's what I've seen from like pictures um, just on the internet so far. But again, I've never seen this horse in person. So this one is going to be the long mane version of the Remington mold. So I think Lazarus only came in the long mane, which is fine because I think, yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's much better in person.
Yeah, so again, absolutely gorgeous. Can get a closer view of him. And he's all spooky and splashy. I love his color. And that mane. Yeah, that mane, the mane is really growing on me. I wasn't sure if I was gonna like the long mane version as much as I do the short mane version, but I think I do, it's different. It's still very realistic though, so. And he has blue eyes. Yeah, so definitely another gorgeous, gorgeous boy. And hopefully y'all can see him pretty well. Hopefully I'm not too close. I don't really know, honestly. So we've got Lazarus, the Halloween horse, and his special cute little card. And we've got Blue Thunder, which actually might be my favorite. Really like how real, how realistic it is. And then we've got Gunner, which is absolutely gorgeous too. And I think, I mean, I do like the gloss and the matte. I think I might like the matte a little bit more, but either way, I'm very happy to now own three Peter Stones on the Remington mold, which I didn't think would happen for a while, just because I can't find them anywhere. I know they're getting ready to do another design on horse um, on June 1st, so I know the Remington mold will be available, so I'm hoping to be able to maybe do one or two um, with that and add a few more to my, I guess, conga now of the Remington mold. Um, and I have actually one more Remington mold coming. Um, it's the, it was from, I believe the Roaring Twenties event. So Gold Digger, that one is coming um, probably next week. And so I'll probably do another unboxing video of him because I was super excited to get him. I actually found someone willing to sell theirs, which was, I couldn't even believe it because I mean, like the past two weeks, I haven't seen anyone like willing to have even put theirs up for sale. So as soon as I saw it and I saw the price, which I thought was reasonable considering how much it costs originally from Peter Stone, I immediately definitely snatched it. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know it's probably a little bit weird because um, I'm new to this and um, it's kind of like, it's, it's kind of funny to talk um, to a camera, not actually a person about these horses. So anyway, hope you guys enjoy. Thank you. Bye.